Hi, it's Elisa. I'm not really sure how I want to intro videos yet. So for now, if you're here, welcome. For the video today, I want to just play around with these new everlasting pencils that I purchased recently. I like the sound that this plastic makes. <laughs> also, I'm not a nail girly, so if plain nails offend you. My apologies. Also, these two broke recently, so I feel like I can't make a uniform sound. But oh well. So it came with three colors. And the one I've been using is the pink one. with these two other ones and then some more tips. So I feel like it's probably a misnomer like at some point they're going to run out but the point is that you don't have to keep sharpening a pencil and since I could not I recently moved and I could not find any pencil sharpener, so I decided just to get these to see how I like them. Right away though, I feel like this design is a little strange because A, this is not the normal size of a pen clip, for example. This is much skinnier, so it can fit on spiral bound things. Whereas this one is pretty thick and won't fit on everything. Like, it doesn't fit on my choir book. And then, it's kind of strange, it has this like, hole here. And it's so you can see the eraser. And the eraser kind of, like, I don't know if you can hear that. If you shake it, you can hear the eraser move around in there. But you cannot access the eraser unless you untwist and open and then take it out. So it doesn't really seem very intuitive. Make much more sense if it was like a normal pencil or mechanical pencil where they just put it on the end. But it's cute and we're just trying it out. So Move these things. Okay. So hello. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Also, something about me is that I do not have consistent handwriting. So sometimes my L's will be like that. Sometimes they'll be loopy. 
sometimes my Y's will be like this. Sometimes they'll be like this. Sometimes they'll be like this. It's literally just whatever comes out of my brain. So what I notice right away is that the lead feels soft. And I'm not sure if I like it. Also, you have to grip the pencil just so, <laughs> so that your fingers are comfortable. So you can kind of tell that this is where you're supposed to grip. And so they really want you, I guess, to have like good penmanship because this is like the proper way to hold the pencil. Although like oftentimes I do hold it like this because it's just easier. But I feel like this one is really meant to be gripped like this. But I feel like if you only grip the pencil one way, you will wear it down. What am I trying to say? You will wear it down in one spot only. It's also starting to squeak. I don't know if you could hear that. Okay, I'm gonna hold it the other way. Holding it in core correctly. gives a sharper sound. And more, more power. I don't know if that's what I meant to say. I think I meant <laughs> gives more power to the lead. I think I, I kind of more mean like, it's just, it makes the lead darker. But I guess power is what I wanted to write just now. You can kind of tell that this right here is darker than all the other stuff that I've written. It gets kind of hard to see on camera these things because The grip just made the lead come out lighter. Okay. Overall, I think I prefer the look of gripping the pencil the oh, can't see. the wrong way and I will switch to a different paper this little notepad I'm a fan of, of 
So when it sounds hopefully it won't be too harsh on your ears. <laughs> oh man. Let's try some other maybe just like shading. This is the other side of the paper I was using. says making moves. It's actually kind of hard for me to figure out what that says. I am dyslexic, so I tend to have trouble when the words are not in a straight line. Or when the letters are not in a straight line. Let's see. I'm shooting. I feel like it's just Maybe the, like the lead material I don't like. It's just kind of loose and squeaky. I hope I'm not giving anyone misophonia. But if anyone does know of a good everlasting pencil, let me know. Um, let's see, do I even remember what brand this is? Hmm. It just says L T O N Dark colors. Hmm. These are not dark colors, but maybe then like the lead is dark. Well, there you have it. I hope you enjoyed this video, and if not, I completely understand because these pens, I feel like, or pencils, excuse me, are not to my liking. So it's alright if they're not to you.